Okie dokie. Let's get right back into what we were doing before. Finally got my haircut done. Haircut is complete. So there's that. I swear I am hearing double. Oopsie poopsie. Okie dokie. That should be better. 100% fine. That's a spicy meat barrel. Right now I'm just waiting for the fucking application to load in. Mm. There we go. I was wondering why I wasn't sh showing up. Okay, Doki. Let's get this right here. I have to say, this haircut I got is really nice. Very wonderful. Pristine and clean. And lovely. It's very nice and airy and when it grows out, it's gonna look so good. It's going to look pretty. Very pretty. Uh. Hmm. You better not make my little message thread expire. Because I got a purchase pending a refund and I need to keep in touch with PayPal with my PayPal Banana check. All right, all systems go. Banana is working on everything, and we are ready to move. All right, looking like Play-Doh. Life is Play-Doh. Aw, yeah. Why am I all the way over here? How did I get here? Ah, fuck. Now I gotta find where I left the freaking moose moose. Where the hell is that damn moose moose? Moose moose. Where are you? Moose moose. There you are. Fuck off. Let me fucking move, bitch. Fuck you. Your stupid ass fucking physics. Fake ass shit always fucking making me all freaking losing stamina way too quickly. Absolute nonsense. Assholio. What was I doing? Come on. Come on, move, you bitch. Hurry the hell up and fucking move. What is your goddamn problem? This is the biggest problem in the game. 
Something so cool has been made so fucking annoying. Jesus fuck. Oh, fuck off. Just move, you bitch. What is your problem? Shut up and take the fucking pain. That's what you fucking get. Disobedience. You get the spurs. Oh, you just had to move, didn't you? Bring this over here. Let's get that over there. Um. There we go. Let's put this in the cart. Uh, just for right now, and then I will start smelting this with a little bit of this. Uh, bad iron's bad iron, doesn't really matter. We got a lot of this decent iron. Uh, 47, 3, 350, 5, 30, 33. 33, 80. Yeah, 33, uh, let's get 20. Look at that in there. Alright, let's fucking go. Let's go. Drop this bullshit. Uh, wait. It's not too bad. What is my... Yeah, maybe I'll use you. Yeah. Okie dokie. Uh, let's open up this furnace. Let's place this thing. Uh, separate this by 14. And then we'll add you right there. Turn on, heat up, all the way to 1500. Give me that 1500 heat. Separate that for later. We're going to use that. And this, we are going to be using my Farge. Uh, fuck off. Alright. Come on, Furnace. Come on, Furnace, come on. Come on, Furnace, come on. What was I doing? Nails. All the poop quality iron goes into nails. Come on, motherfucker, come on. Come on, motherfucker, come on. Alright. And I should still have time to go all the way into town. And then uh, back over here. If this moose would fucking learn obedience. Why are you so slow? Pull it! Pull it, you disobedient fucker! Move! Go down! 
and quit being a baby. Move. Oh god, fucking move. Move. Thank you. I'm gonna make more uh, repair kits. And I'll get back. Surfing on the waves of the sand Them stationary waves made by the wind Surfing up the valleys and over the mountains and the hills Rolling through just keep on going and surfing on the land waves. Surfing on the land waves with my moose cart. With my moose cart. I'm surfing and there's no way that'll crash. Unless my moose being an ass. While I surf the land waves far, very far. While I surf the land waves and park my horse cart in the town where I'm bound to get my nails and my softwood billet so I can make some repair kits. I got small little repair kits that I can use to fix town. So I'm going, getting them, and going around. I'm getting everything prepared to finally get carefree when I got the nails in my pocket. Is that all the nails? I'm gonna make more nails, right? I'm gonna make, yeah, make more nails. All right, let's go where around softwood. Softwood. Uh, I can make seven. Seven softwood. Seven. Seven. Uh, I can also make medium repair kits, but that requires leather that I cannot do. Mass produce. Thank you. Ah, oh, fuck. Did I run out of knife? I ran out of knife. Dang it! God dang it! Now I need to find more of that stuff. I can't find anything, because this damn shit over here is made out of fucking rocks and stuff. I didn't mean to do that. Look for materials. Branch. Pita chips. Pita chips are weird. Oh, Flint. Yeah. 
All right, it's like, let's make a knife. Eh, yeah, make a couple. Back to making them repair kit. Oh, I'm building maintains almost sixty. Wow, I am. This is fucking going quick. I am blazing through these levels. Wow. All right, let's freaking go and see what I can repair. I didn't mean to do that. Fuck you. All right. Ah, what the fuck? Fuck off with your fucking teleporting all my face directions. <sighs> Annoying. All right, let's get this done. Fix everyone's stuff just because I am just the nicest guy. And that's the kind of guy that I am. I am so great. Just the best. And so humble. Just very humble. Probably the most humble, in fact. Yeah. <laughs> Do these wear? Nah, they're fine. There's like three whole fucking furnaces right here. Drying frame. Do you break? Kinda. I might as well repair these. Just for funsies. I am such a nice guy. <laughs> nah, what are you at? Nah, it should be fine. Bam! Done with that. Wow, that's a lot of tubs. Uh, Alright, let's repair you. Oh, yeah. Get them good ass repairs, baby. Yeah. Let's repair this too, man. I am so good at repairing stuff. I'm just the best. Oh yeah. One go, not even a problem, bro. No fucking problemo. What is this? Oh yeah, knife. I don't need you. I don't need it. I don't need it. Come on. Come on. Alright. Let's get this thing back up and running, buddy. Moose caught. Away! Da -da 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 -da. Na 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 da 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 I don't mean to do that. Na 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 na
Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> Motion sickness. Oh fuck. Oh that oh the Oh that hurts to watch. I can't watch that. Come on, Moose Moose. I know you can go faster than that. Go. Y'all. Nay. Winnie. Well, there, Moose Moose. Careful not to drop the cart. I gotta flatten these roads out eventually. Come on, Mr. Moose Moose, you can handle it. Mm. All right, let's go. Let's go. Use that forward momentum. You're not using the forward momentum. Come on. Go. Get over the freaking hill. You bitch. What are you? A man or a mouse? Come on. You're supposed to be stronger than a horse. This is moose power. Be good. Do better. Go up the dang hill, you some bitch. Come on, move it. Wiggle your jiggle ass way up there. Come on now. Don't know why you have trouble getting up. If I can go to the doctor, you have them problems, bitch. Go on. Damn it. Go. Go up the damn thing already. You sorry sack of shit. Get up there. Come on. Get up there. Before I put chains on your hooves. Fucking force your way up there. Come on. Up. Up. I know the road's not done. We get up. God damn it. Why? Why are you being so difficult? Why are you floating? Stop floating. Go forward, you slow bitch. Jiminy Christmas, you're going slow. Go up the fucking hill. Why are you so stupid? Why are you stupid? Fucking move. Move. You annoying little bitch. Come on, you moose fuck. Jesus Christ. Get up. Move on. You're almost on flat land. It's a gentle incline. What is wrong with you? Go up the gentle incline. Oh, well, you are so annoying, you difficult fucker. Yeah. <sighs> you're 
You're annoying. Right, let's get this thing back up. Get that heat going for us. And now we play the waiting game. Anytime now. Anytime now. Don't mind me, just scraping my feet, making sure that they're nice and clean and smooth. Smooth feet or happy feet? Don't give me no dang old bunion! Sure would be nice if someone was on. It's very lonely here. Oh, fuck my ear. I can't seem to hit the low care. Come on. Come on, motherfucker, come on. Come on, motherfucker, come on. Nobody is on right now.
Oh yeah, time to make them lumpies. How do I... How do I move you? How do I move you? Hello. Hello. Hello, my honey. Hello, my baby. Hello, Hello my ragtime gal. Hi. Mm, currently making more nails. My furnace seems to have died. Hmm. Why? Oh, I see. That's because it's broken. <laughs> Duh. Yeah, grinding the skill is very tiresome because I'm basically having to just keep on making, uh, what's it called? A certain type of stone. I'm sure you're doing fine. Yeah. It'll get done eventually. Yes. Da -da 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 No, stop running. Stop moving. <sighs> I'm almost level 60 building maintain. Nice. Yes. Very nice. Very nice indeed. He's pretty tight. Tight like a tiger. Was it Twiny the Twigger? No, we don't. We don't talk about that guy. Uh, hey Doug, you want to get in the voice chat? We got Doug Demidone, owner of the Dimsdale Demidone. What do you mean, let you in? I'm a, I'm in general voice. General voice and fuzzies discord a. Yes, I should probably put more coal in here, just to keep things nice and toasty. Get all these nice little lumpies. Give me all the lumpies, dang it. Why is it not giving me my lumpies? Oh god, it's not giving me lumpies. My lumps. Evening. No. It's afternoon. I think Doug's muted. Or at least he's deafened. He so has multiple there. accounts. Ah. My you gotta listen to an actual guy named Doug Dimidome, not the owner of the Dimsdale Dimidome. <laughs> Sorry if my voice is kind of weak. I just... Doug Dimidome, owner of the Dimsdale Dimidome. You're very quiet. Yeah, because it doesn't want to wake up half of my house. Alright. 
half of your house? Damn, that's the other one. I didn't think that through. <laughs> Check. <laughs> That's not the button that I wanted to press. There we go. Um, situation updates. I have purchased an Omega account for all of my Dutch Madon accounts. That sounds uh, rather disgusting. They will all have mining party. Seven days. Ew. A.K.A. Doug Dim and Diggers. Oh. That is something. For. It is something. Yep. You are correct on that, sir. I'm in need of a whole gallon of water because I'm thirsty. Yeah, I'm eating fucking pita chips. I need... I need something to quench my dry throat. Yeah. Well, good thing I planned to get into alcohol business and, uh, this. Eventually. Yeah, absolutely no idea what you said because I don't really pay attention to anything. Well, there is a thunderstorm at my city. So I heard that. Thanks. <laughs> yeah, sorry for that. Mm -hmm. Not someone flushed the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> All right. God is currently taking a shit on you. God. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I feel like every day. You know, it's sad that I can change mm -hmm. my account name. I cannot change your dog. A moment of silence for his unrenameable account. Doug, damn a damn. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, not again. You started it. I know. I am, in fact, Tug Dimmit. <laughs> You're a Doug Dimmit decoy. The owner of the Doug Dimmit Digging Corporation. Quit being so Doug Dimmit delusional. Ooh, actually. Wait, I will. Ch oh, I know. Mm -mm. I will delete that corporation and rename. But why, though? Duck Dimma Digging. What does a corporation do? Um, you can have stations that earn you money. Plus, you can have wars, you can have taxes to our stuff. You can sell products on lower price, on higher prices. Hmm. First, I have to take all the corporation's money. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, you wouldn't want to lose that. Social corporation. Uh, how do I delete? Hmm. All right, got a search. Let's see. You put your arms around me and I'm home. Vroom vroom. I just got a haircut today. 
and it feels really good because it's hot right now. So I got breeze going through my hair strands. What temp? Um, I think it was like 88. <laughs> I wish it was 88. One second, I will be back in a few minutes. The temp all week has been in the 90s. Yep. Yeah. During that heat wave, it was nearly 120. And that's how it is around here. Yay for living in the desert. I live in Cali. I live in New Mexico. That's where my grandpappy is at. Well, actually, he's... Yeah. That's where he, uh... Is buried. I think my uh, grandma's parents used to live over there. A lot of her family is over in New Mexico. I like it up in Pecos. It's nice and cold. Yeah, I live more toward more closer to Texas than Pecos. Gross. That's disgusting. Just now would not know how to flush a fucking toilet. Disgusting. Should have flushed that toilet. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 58. But I'm 58. So I'm nearly to 60. Hoping I can find a blueprint that I can fucking do that isn't having me do point 12 of a level every second for every time I put a stone in. This is getting old. You're getting old. Oh, I felt like an old man. You do? Yeah, I sleep, four, I sleep 10 hours and wake up for 14. Feel exhausted. I'm already feel exhausted like when I wake shit. up. You know, mostly because I have to deal with life. I mean, I have to deal with life as well, but right now, with Corona, I don't know what the fuck's going on. I'm tired of trying to poke people to figure out what the fuck's going on. Why are you poking people? Well, because they don't answer. Maybe it's because you're do poking them. To annoy them. I gotta do something to catch their attention. That makes them not want to give you attention. Yeah, but there's a certain point where their fuse finally breaks and then they have to. Well, I mean, I mean, you say that, but until you get a restraining order, then, you know. I mean, if they give me a restraining order, <laughs> I'd be happy, because then I don't have to dump them again. <laughs> I'd love to get one from my boss, because he's nothing but a cunt. Why? I will be working there, sitting on the computer, doing my job. Someone will come in and ask for some technical help. And he will yell across the uh, hall, saying, 
Hey, kid, get off your phone and help this guy. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> and they'll be staring directly at me as he's yelling at them. And I have to go with the straightest face possible sign. He does that a lot. <laughs> Are you ever on your phone? He caught me once dazing off into my phone because I was sitting there. There was nothing to do at work. He had no job for me. I was waiting for him to give me a new job. <laughs> I'm sitting there, and I just sort of go into a transit stare. And I just <laughs> happen to be looking at my phone as I'm like, sitting there with my arms on the desk. Not even, like, paying attention. He could see that my eyes were completely out of focus. He says, hey, get off your phone. I'm like, huh? <laughs> I was sitting there in a daze thinking about something. I, what I, was thinking about. I guess that's his new favorite way of getting your attention. <laughs> well, he might be finding himself without a fucking worker at this rate. Because the other guy's already leaving. Because he's tired of his bullshit. Cause that ain't even the only thing he does. He called this guy who is bigger than me and is basically the manliest construction worker guy you could find. He calls him a pansy <laughs> for fucking crying over his friend's death. Oof. Now this wasn't just any friend. This was a childhood family friend that he's known most of his life. Calls him a pansy. Damn. Can you see why I'd like... I'd be okay with a restraining order, but... Eh. But that's working here in my state. How is he otherwise? If he's not bitching about us, or he can't hear because he forgets his fucking hearing aids, since he's that fucking old, he's okay. Hmm. He's good to work on under whenever he's not in his moods. <laughs> But I will say the one benefit I love having over working there is I basically I get to wear shorts all day. Oh, that's so nice. Fucking, I would have to go it's every time little... for like a, what is that shit called? Loading and unloading type of warehouse work. Exclusively plant pants all the time, no matter what. And like sometimes it's not even you're not even lifting stuff that that's heavier at all and oh it gets so hot and sweaty it would be so nice just to fucking wear shorts. The thing is, I asked him before uh, any before he got any influence saying telling him otherwise <laughs> that he, he was not supposed to, and I knew I was his first uh, recruit. So I asked him, he said, yeah. He now has to hold that in the fucking <laughs> give him shit. <laughs> Cause you said, boss. Besides, I like wearing... He, I think shorts are much better for me because I need 
as much mobility as I can possible. Wearing pants, <laughs> they can get pretty tight. <laughs> yeah. It also depends on the pants. I have some pretty stretchy pants uh, in my closet. A couple pairs of them, and they're so nice. Yeah. I mean, I like sweatpants whenever it's cold, but whenever it gets to ridiculous weather up here, I'm like, boss, I'm gonna need shorts, or this is gonna be a fucking nightmare. I think get off the phone, kid, is a good trade off for shorts. <laughs> It, but it's, that's fine with me, as long as it's more of the, oh, back in my day and the pansy shit. <laughs> yeah. Because you know, you're calling the one guy who can do construction work for you a pansy. <laughs> like, literally, at the... At the last part before we had to go into quarantine, he literally said, I'm quitting, and left to go work at a donut shop. That would actually pay him better. The the guy that he called a pansy? Yeah. <laughs> so he's at a construction worker, and I can't do construction work because I am basically a cripple. Damn. By the state's knowledge, I am a cripple. Why? I have Ehlers Dandros in both of my legs, and to say it in the shortest terms possible, I think kneecap go pop out every time you try <laughs> doing anything athletic. Gross. I'm just imagining a fucking slippery chicken. And looking at the bone through, like, the skin. Yeah, I think I've taken off that leg. Now I have that happen constantly whenever you train and do anything. Yucky. Welcome to my life. It's a living hell. At least you have a life. And alright. Why, you're not working? I don't even know if I have a job. <laughs> the whole quarantine shit sort of got my facility kind of, well, fucked. Mm. So I work for this, um, I work for a college and, uh, under my boss is a program to help, uh, train oil field workers with the whole corona shit going on and they without the need of any of those workers and also the fact that this has to be an in-person class because they have to deal with very high-tech equipment mm -hmm. it's sort of not really able to be done you train for construction uh, I'm not trained for construction. I was just bought on because I was good at tech and mm. good at troubleshooting. So what do they do? Uh, it's anything from the oil field to hydraulics mm. to working on uh, the computers that run street lights. Mm. Neat. But I'm just the guy who's basically the fucking maid there. Because none of them know how to clean up after each other. Or for themselves. Like, I've. In, we have these boxes that we just call cats that are just full of parts. I found damn spiders in those fuckers. <laughs> and they weren't dead. Them fuckers were living. I'm sure they were. Wait, one time I was just like, nope, fuck this shit. I literally, I sealed the box with a can of Raid. I just basically stabbed the Raid, threw it in the box, shut it, and let it. And <laughs> leave it there for an hour. It's like, fuck you, spider. <laughs> I 
That's one way to get rid of a spider. Boss wasn't happy that I stabbed the can of raid, but I said I'd pay for it later. <laughs> I didn't want to get bit. Because these fucks, these fuck sticks will let spiders crawl throughout the fucking box. Ew. Well, what kind of spiders were they? I didn't know. I wasn't gonna check. All I could tell was I saw black limbs and I was like, fuck this shit, I'm out. Smoke oh, me. hell no, motherfucker. Come on, fire in the hole. Go on, Reed. <laughs> 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 the only way I was gonna get that shit done. I cleaned up so much out of that facility and there were so many missing parts. But it came to a point to where I was going through the kits. I literally told my boss, I swear to God, if one of these walls is a fake wall and I find more fucking parts, <laughs> I'm gonna be pissed. Because we had over 300 different parts missing. Uh. What were the I parts for? For, like, the machines and shit mm. that they were supposed to train on. It even went to the point where I was looking in one of these little boxes to find, find where the safety glasses were. Mm hmm Lo and behold, 28 of the... I found 20 of those actual parts. They wow. were stuffed into the cabinet where you're supposed to put the safety glasses. That's terrible. Back. Ah, oh, why? <laughs> but yeah. That is what I had to deal with, and I had to basically reverse engineer everything because I wasn't trained at all I'm trained in computers I got trained yeah. to be the cleaning and de-infesting and basically secretary of my boss hey wait what hey what are we talking about here my cunt of a boss oh <laughs> I remember when I had to fix his cabinets full of documents and resort them. And then he decided whenever I had it all done, neatly stacked and all ready, mm -hmm. oh, it's backwards. Do it again. You literally Oof. just couldn't go to the other side to find them. Clearly not. <laughs> they were backwards. They were that much of a lazy fuck. They couldn't do it the other way around. So I had to spend another day on that damn drawer. <laughs> Just because it could, it couldn't be A B C. It was Z onwards. Seems reasonable. <laughs> and it wasn't like one of those that you pull out and it's just one file size. No, it's where you pull it out and then you have all the files there in front of you. It was side on instead of straight. Hmm. It was literally him just wanting to be a cut and make me work more. Well, is it difficult? It's a lot of fucking files. Because it's one for every student that has been there through all ten years. You didn't do any snooping? I mean, at one time, he actually had me to where I had to search the files to find their 
the numbers of all these kids to ask them, Hey, where are you now? And what are you doing? How successful was our program? <laughs> It went to the point where we had five, we had to do it for five days, and it was me and my co-worker working on that. Wow. For him to finally tell us we don't have a deadline after all. <laughs> Can you see why I don't like my boss at all? I literally... I nearly had a vein pop one of the days. Because I was pissed. But yeah. I fixed that entire damn program. <laughs> and uh, the guy who's hired than my boss. He came in one day, and he went to the back just to find someone, because my boss had ran out to go get some shit. Mm. And um, he comes in the back, and he looks at how clean it is, and he says, Who did this? <laughs> how is this possible? And I say, <laughs> All I can say is, At this rate, I'm ready to go put a maid outfit on Halloween night and come here to work. <laughs> like, I, I was about, uh, on the final day before I left, I was like, if I have to come back to work here, expect me in a maid dress and heels. Because <laughs> I was basically a glorified maid at that point. Well, I mean, you still time. did a good job, so. Yeah. There's that. Yeah. My father gives me shit because I'm like, he's like, oh, why isn't your room completely tidy like that place? <laughs> I have a few things that I leave around. I'm like, <laughs> I don't get paid to clean my room. <laughs> All I get is you guys bitching at me if I don't. Uh, it's even like not that bad. It's it's literally just because I will leave a cup somewhere for a day. Why would you leave a cup somewhere for a day? Because I'm like, oh, I need to go do this real quick and forget about it. Because I need to do things. How do you forget about a cup? <laughs> Where do you so leave your cup? <laughs> like on a shelf. What? Or on my desk. How do you, is how do you forget if it's on your desk? It's like forget about it because you know I'm like, oh, I need to go pick up this person and take them over to this place. So I forget about it, get the thing done, and then I'll be like, oh, I'll do it later. Oh, and you're also a taxi driver. That. Interesting. <laughs> I'm basically a taxi driver for my friends and family. Yeah. Even though I hate driving in this town because god damn it sucks. Why is that? It's literally a game of for every driver on the road, it's it's literally Oh look, I'm trying to drive home. Let's see if I can get there the quickest. And that's everyone's style of driving in this town. Over in Pecos, the roads are all are usually pretty clean. Oh no, they're clean. It's just drivers are... God! They are the most aggressive people ever. <laughs> like, whenever um, 
there was supposed to be the drive by um, graduation for all the high school students. Mm -hmm. It was the worst. We had we were literally sitting there taking bets on how many wrecks there were going to happen. Why? Because drivers here are shit. Hmm. That was like 15. Right next to the high school. Are you serious? Yeah. How? People drive like retards in this town. <laughs> My feeling is like, why do you hate driving so much? I don't know. Let's go look outside to see how many wrecks there are. Let's go do it. One, uh, uh, uh. Two, uh, uh, uh. Three, uh, uh, uh. Wrecks. Three wrecks in total. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. And it's the worst thing ever. It's the worst thing ever. Worst thing ever. Worst thing ever. Worst thing ever. Building maintains at 60. Nice. But yeah, that that's basically driving in my town. Mm. On the way home from... A literal, um, from a, a test that I had that took early in the morning, it was the SRT or some shit. I'm, I'm making my way back, and we finally, we started to enter the city, or the little town, not city, uh, we, me and my friend, and this car decides that he's going to get real tight and squeeze in with, uh, this other car in front of me. Hmm. And that car decides that they're instantly going to stop in the middle of the road as someone's also basically tail-ending me. Uh. I had to be so precise so that A, the person behind me wouldn't wail, wail into the back of my car. How do they get their fucking driver's license? Because they go to Eunice another town they're the most lax people ever about it ew literally they make you drive they make you take four left turns and then take you right back to the facility and say yeah you're good We need stricter dudes at the DM booze. Like, literally, that happened and I have to go, and I know why driving in this town is garbage. You're driving? Oh no, I drive pretty well. I haven't had a wreck, ever. Ah. Knocking on wood. Well, the first time I ever fucking drove, I I felt like I shouldn't have such power and responsibility. <laughs> I, I don't like that feeling either. I have it all the time. Yeah, I, I don't go out. <laughs> I nearly have a heart attack every day on the road. Because it's that bad. I nearly have a heart attack just going outside. Too many people. But yeah, that's... That's been my experience with driving. And also... I repaired your kiln. Very... Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm repairing everyone's shit. All the shizen. All the shizen. But yeah. 
I'm now level 60. Huzzah! I just now gotta make it to level 90. I don't see how that's unreasonable. It's just more finding something I can put in a 4x4 four four area up here that takes shaped stone. stone. Also, one while I'm going to close my door because my brother has friends over and they're watching loud TV. Yeah, I can hear it. <laughs> Do these wear? No, they're fine. What about you? Yeah, you wear. Let's get you fixed up. Come on, little training dummy. I return. But yeah, that should help a little bit. You still might hear it a little bit because they're using the built in speakers to the house. Mm hmm. So it's extra loud. Can you hear a plane, a TV, and a fan going on at the same time from my mic? No. Good. Good. Because there's a plane, TV, and a fan right going right into my mic right now. <laughs> Sounds like fun. Ah, a phone just rang. Not mine, though. Mine does ring. Unless it's singing Cruel Angel Theosis, which it did eight minutes ago. No, the phone I heard went doo 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 doo. Not that it's not any of my phones or devices. Okay. Oh, fuck. Everyone's stuff is fixed. Call me Bob the Builder. Because I can fix it. <laughs> now for me to make nothing but castle uh, wall corners, because that's all I can make. Sad. At my highest level. So I can actually finish this goddamn grind. Let's see if there's anything that needs work on over here. Repair kits. If you can't find anything else, just go make like a bark box or something and whack it with like a primitive shovel or something. You can only hurt stuff with a torch. Out the primitive, primitive gear? Just anything. Uh, yeah. Unless you get like siege weapons and shit like that. Yeah, there's a siege torch too. Tend to do point oh four XP. That's the best I can get. 
bunch of candy juice. So the grilled cheese burrito from Taco Bell is literally just a fucking quesarito, but instead of a cheese layer, there's a... Uh, they literally just grilled cheese on top of the burrito. So like they slap cheese on a fucking stove, and then they put the burrito on top of it. And just grill it on. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's, it's an interesting idea. Yeah, so you, you just have like a slab of cheese right on top of the burrito. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's basically my cooking. <laughs> basically. In the most go, basic okay, sense of the word. Let's go, chunk of cheese, good. Grill it. Fuck it. <laughs> I prefer the case of Rita. That's why I gave up on being a cook for my career. So I was too lazy. Yeah, so are the people who actually cook. <laughs> That's true. Do you know a couple lazy cooks? Oh, fuck yeah, I love water. Very special places. Mm -hmm. You just cough up all that blood. Oh, yeah. Especially love choking on it. Yeah. Especially after whatever you scream, more daddy. <laughs> Yikes. I just want to die, dude. <laughs> Fucking weirdo. <laughs> I mean, at this rate, the world's basically been trying to kill me for years. <coughs> I've been too much of a fucking stubborn bastard to die. Ah, uh, fuck. Oh, I'm stuck. Oh god. No. Okay. Woo! All these fucking apple trees. Slab of cheese. No, I'm getting stuck on all these apple trees that Fuzzy planted at my house. <laughs> I mean, I had enough. Of the wood. I'm not here. I don't want the apple trees for the wood. I want them for the aesthetic. But he planted so goddamn many, it's blocking off my house. I can't get my moose cart through. Go through the mountain. I guess you could call him a genie then. No. The only 
only kind of gene TS are the ones with an extra chromosome. <laughs> I don't know what to do now. I guess I can make ingots. Shaggy's always trying to steal my stuff. And use my stuff. Without asking. Sounds like that's a pain in the ass. Oh, he is. <laughs> like, I worked hard for my shit. Quit breaking it. You're making me work hard to keep it fixed. I don't want to work hard. That's the opposite of what I want to do. Ah, uh, fuck. Damn. Well, getting XP is gonna be fun. Why? So... In order to get architect up, I have to put in one item at a time, and then go into the building sequence to add a, to add material to a building. And I'm I use shape rock because I can get that very easily. Uh, I just go and like build everything almost to the max, just one less, and then I deconstruct the shit. I mean, yeah, but then I'd have to make hardwood boards and I could use that for something else and that would take away from the tree count. I don't or know having about to having to use mass. that. Besides with shaped rock you don't really need to do that as much. What are you trying to level up? What are you trying to level up? Architect. 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 Thing after Mason. I know. But yeah. What level are you on? Uh, level 60. 60. 60.5 at the moment. But yeah, what I have to do is basically put one item in and then just do that till I eventually complete the building, or complete the part that I can easily just remake the material for. Yeah, well then you're gonna have yeah. parts flying about, and breaking them takes forever. No, that's just why I deconstruct before it ends the craft. But yeah, basically I'm just to dig rock in order to continue. But yeah, I basically have to do the XP rate, have to deal with the XP rate, which is very, very little. Which is basically point zero four hmm. per basically ten second timer. Ooh, I'm almost level one hundred virgin. Nito. Level one hundred what? Forging. Ooh. I'm far away from getting a hundred smelting. And that's going to be nice. It's going to be pretty nice. And then I need to work on armor smithing. 
I'm at level 45 for that. I'm gonna try for level 100 eventually on the architect side, but yeah. All I can say is getting your home done is gonna be a big project. Well, I mean, yeah, it's, it's fucking architecture. I don't know if you know this, but architectural projects take forever. I mean, I'm not even completing it. It's just getting the skill. Yes. The skill is stupid. <laughs> it does take a while. None like the other ones. I was just like, oh, look, I blitzed through the entire thing in a minute. Be right back. Okay. I'm a salty banana. Hello, oh, salty banana. I'm a salty strawberry. Oh, that's gross. I don't want to be smoothied with you. Gross. What do you, you don't want to do this with me, Django? No, thank you. I'm good. I think I'll go on a pizza. <laughs> Baked banana on a pizza. Don't. I mean, there's pineapple on pizza. Pineapple on pizza's wrong. Gordon Ramsay himself agrees. 
That's because people just throw fucking throw it on fucking pizza. They 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 don't bake it. Here's the situation. Okay? If you want pineapple on pizza, I don't think you should put pineapple on pizza. I think you should get the pineapple juice and mix it in with the dough a little, make, replacing a little bit of that water that you're putting in. You know what I'm saying? Also, that, that way you get a little bit of pineapple flavor in your dough instead of all over the cheese, which makes it terrible. I think it's more for the assonance is why they do it. No. It's terrible. No, for me, I haven't tasted any good. Uh, pizza Look, my grandma makes the best pineapple cake, and I think certain things that you do with that recipe can be implemented in making the pizza dough. So that way, you have a little bit of that pineapple flavor along with your cheese and your tomato. And your fucking oregano, your robust, delicious tomato sauce, and your, your meats. You get it all nice and, and good. You, you get that nice consistency that instead of the disgusting fucking piece of shit, fucking fibrous ass fruit right on your damn cheese. Yeah. It's too sweet. That's also, but it's also because of how they put it on there. It's too Most sweet, people... too sour. If you just lay it on there, but if you bake it, it's not as juicy. Doesn't matter. Either way, the fiber, it's too fucking juicy no matter what. If you put the slices on. Not gonna do not gonna do it. You should mix pineapple juice with the pizza dough. Yeah, I bet you know big corporations won't do that. Just, you know, but it's so easy. It's... But then they would have to have a separate dough, and they'd have to train people not to use that dough on every fucking pizza. Well, that's only if they're fucking frozen pizza maker pieces of shits. Make your fucking pizza from scratch, you bitch. That's what I say to them. Fucking bullshit ass frozen pizzas. Frozen ass dough. Pre made bullshit. I need to do that and also get more food. You like tea? I do like tea. What kind of drink? Arizona, Golden Peak, Brisk, uh, Pack, Tea Bag? Uh, I like, uh, what's it called? We, we, uh, I love, uh, Lipton green tea for the ones in the bottle. Why? But for my tea bag type, I like also the, just the Lipton tea bags. Mm. What you... Or basically boiled water. Let's see. I know, I'm a heretic. Lipton green tea bottle makes me want to throw up. Arizona's alright, but it's too fucking sweet. And it has a little too much acidity in it. I like their raspberry tea. I like their uh, their energy tea. It make, it gives me acid reflux, but goddamn, I love it. 
<laughs> I'll get S reflex whenever I drink things. I get S reflex whenever I look at some of my father's diets. Nerds. Give me the ingredients. There we go. Smart label coming soon so we can get your ingredients for your Lipton green tea as soon as possible. Sadly, we don't have it right now. We can't just take a picture of the nutritional facts. Because fuck you. I mean, I have one of the bottles right here in front of me. Sugar content and calories, go. Uh, let's see, it has fats, 0%. Well, well yeah, I would hope so. 150 <laughs> milligrams. Total carbs, 25 grams. Sugar, 25 grams. Includes added sugars, 50%. Protein, 0. Vitamin C, 200... 126 milligrams. I'm not gonna lie to you, I wasn't really paying attention. 100 calories. Okay, okay. You wanna know how many calories is in brisk tea? 70. I mean, I like brisk tea occasionally. I like their lemon. Yeah, if I'm going to be too lazy to make tea, I'll, I'll go for some brisk. Usually I just drink water, though. And that's how I don't have diabetes. 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 Diabetes, diabetes, diabetes. <laughs> I, I actually remember my day, my days in the band, where I had to listen to that song over at least three hundred times. No oh dear. So, oh. All they would do is go through that one part over and over again. Because two kids would keep on fucking up the choreography. <laughs> I was about to yell, I swear to God, if you guys won't get this together. I'm about ready to do the choreography for you, and I'm a cripple. <laughs> and I'm sitting here on the metronome. Where did Doug Nimmodome go? Uh, he left, I think his stuff was glitching out. Hmm. But yeah, he was bad. <laughs> Probably because of how many fucking EVA counts he has. He has almost 10. Yeah, that's probably a reason why. Active at the same time on one computer. <laughs> yeah, it'll fuck your system right up. Uh, 
Well, you got the one because that's all I need. I am stuck on Band-Aid because my Band-Aid stuck on me. Please call your doctor if it stays on for over 10 hours. <laughs> Think of that being a fucking part of the ad. <laughs> if you or a loved one has been diagnosed with mesothelioma. <laughs> mesothelioma. So Philly Oma. Mm, it's the Philly Why is there no flint in this goddamn mm. mountain? It's okay. To make another goddamn hammer. Goddamn. Goddamn, goddamn. Don't die, we need you. <coughs> Lies! Give us the mm. Well, I think I hear someone. Either that or I'm hearing an animal. Hail no. To the no, no, no. Hail to the no. To the no, no, no. Hail to the no. To the no, no, no. Hail to the no. To the no, no, no. That guy's song is funny as fuck. <laughs> Have you seen the full song? No, I just, I just know the saying. More from a different story that I listened to, that I've listened to, hmm. which was pretty hilarious. Especially since it included a black lady that went, oh, hell no. That lady was fucking amazing. No idea what you said, but I feel like it's racist. <laughs> oh, it's just the accent. It was, well, it's more of what she actually said, because she did say it like that. But it was a racist remark that caused her to say that. I don't know what you're talking about. It's basically a story. This ain't this ain't no Rose Park. You're getting off this damn bus, and she went, "Oh hell no, you're getting off this bus right now." <laughs> Especially since she is basically the owner of the hotel. Oof. Well, not the owner, but the big exec on there. Okay. There's a convention horror stories that I thought I'd... Because there's some pretty funny uh, happenings that go on at conventions. Ugh. Oh, fuck. Not a lot of them I can repeat, though, because some of them are a bit is gay. Some of them are a bit gay? Risque. Oh, risque. Gross.
And I'm not sure if you're streaming or not. And I'd rather not get you banned off Twitch. Of course I'm streaming. <laughs> yeah, that's why I was like, mm, probably shouldn't tell the exact story. Yeah, I, I wanted fucking Duke to be in here, but... Apparently he's having issues glitching, I suppose. I don't fucking know. Uh, who knows at this point? The world's fucked. I wanna... To fucking have him do some more Doug Dimmadone jokes. Mm, looks like he's Doug Dimmadone, though, for today. the playlist that I made where oh where is the playlist that I made I swear to Jeb if they delete oh good it's still here good Oh, thank goodness. Uh. Go away, Chrome ads. Oh, you know what? I might as well do something, because there's been something on my mind. So I actually will react to this ad. Blowing it in the fucking face. Window capture. Yeah, fucking shotgun. Alright, let me get this scene ready. Let's get this window capture of a meow. And then we're gonna swap the properties. Oh, fuck. Right here. I have that. Fit to screen. Uh, we're going to, I think, alt. Yeah, alt. Okay. We're going to do this. Do that. Okay. Uh... You want to hop on my stream and see what I'm going to be talking about? Uh, I don't think I put a link to your stream. Uh, I can put a link. Let me just get you one over here. Once I go back to Twitch. Twitch a dirty do. Twitchery dirty do. Oh, Kali Dokali, let me see if I can do this. Copy the URL. URL, my URL. Dog damn a donkey. Let it, there we go. I, uh, I put it in post stream chat. Alrighty, uh, coming up. <laughs> Oakley dokley. What up? Do you see it? Uh, do, you, do you see what I'm looking at? <clears throat> delayed. Oh, now it's showing up. Alright. It shows the lady. Yeah. It's very it's switching Do you see this shit? This dude, this is a serious fucking security issue. This fucking dumb lady just decides to fucking take this computer that some random ass fucking car decided to put into her booth and she let through 
without fucking giving it a fucking little parking ticket for. And somehow it's continuing her game that she's already having. So how do they get that information there for her to be able to fucking play this game that she's playing? <laughs> I mean, that would be about the most secure as, like, my fucking, uh, jobs. Shit. <laughs> it's bad. This is fucking... She, the bitch just fucking takes it! You don't know what's fucking installed on that computer. Who the fuck was that like, guy? Really? Literally my boss. The funny thing is, is you know how he says that, oh, I, I play on my phone all day. He sits there and plays Candy Crush and says that his fucking doctor tells him to play Candy Crush for, the, <laughs> for his fucking therapy for his, basically, uh, I think it was, what was it? It wasn't his attention span, it was, eh, fuck. His memory. Ugh. Well, I sent you the link of the of the song that this uh, that that part was for, the hell to the now. Um, thing. Where the dude's like, hail to the now, to the now, no now, hail to the now, hail to the now, to the now, no no. It's a pretty great song. <laughs> Hilarious. All right. That was enough time to complete you. all my little bits. Now I can watch you as I play my own. Ah. Because, yeah, you're having three <gasps> monitors. <laughs> Thank you for following, Schmidt. I need people to watch. Well, if you want to go to sleep, I'm the kind of person you're looking for. Man, I'm getting the fuck, because I need to get me some nails. Some nails. Nails to repair the nails. Actually, I think this thing broke again. Ah, oh, I did. Okay. Yep. 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 I forget. Did I bring? I. I don't know if I brought softwood billies to make some more uh of these repair kits. Let me see. No, I did make a bunch of repair kits though. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna go head back into town and go. Get me some more softwood billies. After I do this. And then you can watch me struggle with getting my fucking moose cart back. <laughs> so this is usually what the fucking stream is all about for, for this game. <laughs> this is mostly what I do. I just sit here and watch bars go up. I mean, that's what I've been doing the entire time as well. <laughs> Just with the different thing I'm doing. Yeah, but people have to sit and watch this. <laughs> well, they don't have to, but if they want to. Is this entertaining enough for you? <laughs> I mean, it gives me something else to watch while I'm sitting here watching Ghosts of... Go see her. Ah. A fucking ghost game where you're a ninja. And a samurai. Dude. Wow, a ghost ninja samurai. Was he also an astronaut and a viking? I mean, at this point. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's what ghosts are basically going to do at this point. At least it's better than Anthem. Uh, what is Anthem? Uh, basically, there's this game where you... It was supposed to be this one where it had vertical, sort of... Where you'd be flying whilst you're doing, like, FPS shooter, looter sort of things. 
Mm. But it was terrible. <laughs> Upon re- release of the game, it was so bad that you would find missing textures everywhere. Oh, wow. Like, literally like, everywhere? Yeah, and like where NPCs there were just like little markers <laughs> that you're supposed to talk to to finish the fucking quest. Oof. This is normal, right? I'm sure that's normal. Yeah, completely normal. <laughs> Get through the hole, baby! You fucking badass moose! Oh, God! Oh, shit. Get the butter out. Yeah, turn that butter. <sighs> All right, there we go. I need to get myself a horse and cart. We. Oh fuck. Ugh. Oh god. This is full speed. This is full speed. <laughs> I am speed. <sighs> there we go. Speed wagon. Speed the wagon. Omaiwa Shindu. Not it. Oh, my God. See how fast I'm going? I'm going so fucking fast, dude. Look at that. Look at that speed. You might as well just call me the Flash. Because I am blazing. You could say you're blitzing. <laughs> Jesus Christ, what's wrong with you, dude? Why would you say that? World War II flashbacks. <laughs> you have just triggered my PTSD. How could you? <laughs> I'm not mad. Whenever I nearly got a fucking firework in the face. I've had that happen before. It was Some delicious. Of my dumbass brother's friends said they were going to do that. We then promptly went inside and let them deal with fireworks from then on. <laughs> Idiots. Are they dead? Nope. Oh. But they sure did tear up my grandmother's car. Oof. They did not understand a thing called fireworks safety. No, I don't think they did. One of them nearly got their face blasted off by a firework once. I would assume so. They they seem like the they, type who are that dumb. They literally looked down the tube of a fucking the barrel of a fucking uh, oh, God. one of those mortar ones. Because it didn't, it didn't seem like it worked. So they went up to it, and just as they, they were about to put their eye towards the hole, thump. Oof. I think you muted yourself. Uh no. Okay. I just pushed to talk. Okay. But yeah, it was, it was just basically thump. Push to talk is weird. Because when you want to react by laughing, um, you have to push to laugh. <laughs> it's not a natural yeah, reaction. Except for me. I have trained myself to be to do that with any mouse. That's very weird and awkward. <laughs> yeah, like people will, people will see this whenever I'm like a, during one of my classes. I will... I will push down my thumb into my hand whenever I'm talking. 
to get that same pressure that I would on my mouse. That's so weird. I've just learned to be like, yeah, I have habits. They're gonna live with me forever. <laughs> but eh. I too have to live with myself. It's terrible. I have to look at myself in the in the mirror. You know how awful that is? Really fucking awful. <laughs> Finally stopped raining on the server. It's it's like the fucking uh, Forgecraft server with how much it rains. Yeah. Cause every time I'm on, I'm like, oh look, it's raining again. Yeah, of course. It's good for the grass. But it's loud as shit. Annoying. Not as loud as dumping rocks on the floor. Have you Are done you that true? yet? Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's, I've done it down the mountain. It's the worst. I had to go into the game down. files and just delete it. <laughs> I couldn't deal with it. Because, did you, did you know that this game has, a? Uh, it has wind sounds. Yeah. It hurts my ears because I want to hear the wind sounds, but they're so quiet, so I had to turn it up, and then, like, I dropped rocks and ruined my whole day. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Sound balancing is good, folks. If you ever do a game, do sound balancing. Yes. It would be very helpful for my ears. Or be able to turn down certain ones while leaving others in instead of just having to completely cut the entirety of the ambient noise. Right. Like say, oh, you don't want to hear rain all the fucking time. I mean, I'd be fine hearing rain, just, you know, less of it. <laughs> Because it's whenever I have to automatically go, oh, I have to be louder so I can be heard because of rain. So I automatically do that and people are like, why are you talking louder whenever it's a random event? It's because I have the trigger of whenever I hear something louder than me, I automatically blare louder than it. I have learned to control that by always being loud. <laughs> so no matter what volume is in my ear, I stay the same terrible volume for everyone else. If I were to do that, my family would kill me. <laughs> <coughs> All right. For me, I have a very booming voice to the point where it will actually ping off bleachers from like a fucking half a football field away. You ever uh, watch Markiplier? Uh, not much anymore, but whenever he was first starting, I did a little. Why did you stop watching? I just, he wasn't really the type of people that I usually watch. Well, what are not the type of people you watch? It, it's more like a lot of other shit that he doesn't really do. Like for me, I listen to a guy who sits there and tells me the history of drinks and makes drinks from video games, anime, and most media. Hmm. I could have sworn though there should have been a lot more softwood billets, but maybe I get I guess I used them all. All right, Moose Moose, let's go. I'm practically Santa Claus. I came here and fixed everyone's toys. So, I mean, I'm, pr I'm probably just the greatest person ever, right? Yeah, we'll go with that. Yeah. And humble. Can't forget humble. 
I'm the most humble. <laughs> yeah. This is gonna be a fun grind for architecture. Because <laughs> I get it at 0 .046 XP per every 10 seconds I put a shaped stone into this. <coughs> oh, that's fun. I gotta do it all the way to level 90. Oh, that's sickening. And it keeps on decreasing, so... And I don't know any ways to increase it without having to go into game files and shit. on the wiki but all it says is this is basically the quickest rate to gain level I think I'm gonna call myself Canadian Santa <laughs> <laughs> I ride a moose off into the villages when nobody's around and sleep and I fix their stuff for them then go back up to your workshop. Mm-hmm. I remember actually seeing your workshop. I was like, huh, someone lives up here. I'm yeah. Blacksmith. Yeah, that's me. I was like, okay, hey, time <laughs> to go to the coast. <laughs> Where I live, because that's what I do. Yeah, my, my place is pretty sweet. It took forever to dig out <laughs> and flatten. Same here. With my little area. Oh, that was funny trying to get that area because I had, I had to figure out which what I wanted to do. And I was like, oh, I'll go with 6.2. And then go over there and I was like, oh, I want to build pathways so the place looks not like dirt. I do that. And then see that, I ha that it makes it to where it's a 6.3. And flattens the ground. Yeah, I still have to clear off space for my my place, and that way I can fit like some walls and and a three story building. And I still need to fucking put dirt down so I can make a little pathway down. That way I don't have to deal with this stupid fucking shit moose cart, always having trouble going up slight inclines. Yeah, that could probably help. to start building the road towards um, my place in the village. It takes so long to move dirt. Just an unnecessary amount of time to move any sort of dirt. Come on, moose cart. Yay, I'm level 61. Oh shit, you're Mexican? I didn't know that. <laughs> oh, you're talking about being level 61. Juan. Juan. I shouldn't say that or I'll get my ass kicked by my Mexican friends. I am Mexican. Mexicans don't yeah. give a shit. <laughs> uh, is there any ones around here, do you? I don't know why. I think they're whitewashed. Uh, <laughs> well, that's because they're anal. Anal whitewashed Mexicans. Real it's Mexicans really don't give a shit. Mexicans around here. It's real hard to tell. They take pride and they will they it's, will beat the shit out of you. Nah, they're just fake Mexicans. Come on, moose cart. Move And at a rock again, shit. Oh, 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 
I got it. Yeah. All right. Real Mexicans don't give a shit about racial remarks. It's because they find humor in it. Yep, and that's why I love some of my friends. Because they will care what I say. They'll even find it funny. Such as when I say, say to my one white friend, because we... We talk about this all the time. We're like, oh, oh, you got your driver's license and you got the one that's, uh, that's, um, this black one. And I said, well, at least you'll run faster from the police. Oof. <laughs> uh, racial stereotypes. <laughs> Best part is, he fucking laughed at it. He's the blackest guy I know. <laughs> Some people are too anal about jokes. Yeah, and they forget that a lot of jokes are actually meant to be that sort of way as a way of trying to uh, take the piss out of something or make it to where it's it's to what there's a there's a term for it. It's not take the piss out of it. It's, um, it's to help deal with reality. Hmm. The play books. <laughs> Said by a comedian that I that I watch. Huh? And he doesn't mean to be racist. It's just that's one of the purest forms of comedy. Racial stereotypes. Because people are like that. <laughs> Like the Kappas out here. Don't get mad because of statistics. Because <laughs> you are perp. I like my kind are known to be the fucking retards. Mm, what are your kind? <sighs> well... My kind are the white people that are just like, ah, we know what we're doing because we're Americans and we're dumb because we believe that fuck yeah, America is a thing. What? Like if my, my Canadian friends say that we are uh, not as smart. Why? Well, because our president and other things. How well, we, what's wrong with our president other than his personality? <laughs> That's what I say. If they would just take away his fucking phone so he'd, so he'd quit. Like, he's a fine and dandy president. And he's just not a great person. <laughs> he's, yeah, he's not a great person. But he's better than Hillary. It's better than a lot of people. Like old Sleepy Ben. He is funny, though. Yeah. Fucking love Trump. He's hilarious as fuck. Yeah. <laughs> Too many pansy ass motherfuckers afraid of speaking the truth because they're afraid of getting canceled. Cancel culture. Crazy. That is true. It's sad to see. Mm hmm. Kind of like interspecies revere. Uh, when Funimation decided to take that on, and they automatically went, oh, this one's about sex. Oof. 
And they were like, yeah, we're not gonna dub this anime, even though we signed the contract for it. Have fun with that. <laughs> Have fun with this one anime you wanted to watch. And was basically the only way to legally have it in America. Unless you wanted the Japanese version. I mean, if someone doesn't want to do something, they're not, uh, they don't, they shouldn't have to. Yeah, they shouldn't have to, but they signed the contract. <laughs> Did they know exactly what's, what was going on in that anime? Yeah. If they did the research. Because this is a company that mm -hmm. is signing a contract. So they didn't do the research. Yeah. Before signing a contract to dub an entire anime. Oof. And there was money they would have gotten for it. Well, I'm sure there, it would, but if it goes against their values and they're too stupid to fucking research... It's kind of, I don't feel like they, yeah. they should. They should definitely get penalized, penalized for it, or they should have a penalty for it. But, uh... They should have a slap on the wrist, but, yeah. They, they don't, I don't feel like they, they should be obligated to. Yeah. If they physically can't, yeah, I get that. But this is more of just, oh, we don't want to do it because it's a lewd anime. About a guy who screws every fucking species. And then reviews them. Yeah, I didn't like that anime. <laughs> I mean, I haven't watched it, but... I mean, would you really want a voice actor who's not... Who, who doesn't really like what they're doing... Doing work... Working for you? Because they won't put their one... They won't put their all. They, they won't do that 100%. Uh, acting job, right? Yeah, but if they ca if they're being cast for that role, and they get casted as that, that means they usually want to be that person, or they're just looking for money. They were stupid, and because it has something that they don't necessarily agree with, or they don't like, or they don't want to have. Slap to their name. I don't feel like they should be obligated to. They should definitely have legal ramifications against them. But yeah, still, do. I don't feel I'm like they should have the to. I'm talking about the company. People, they got casted. And basically, they could cast anybody they wanted. They would take the role. Yep. Yeah. They had the budget for it. Uh-huh. It's more of just the people that are just like, oh, we don't want this because we're high-level execs and we want to basically not have that in this place. I guess fuck you. Now there's no legal way to get it without in the English version. I mean, oh well. <laughs> eh. It's just a little bit of like, well, Guess it's time to put my pirate hat on. Just yar her shiver me he. Hey, at least four kids didn't get in on it. <laughs> what? At least four kids would have got gotten it. The ones that made the Yu-Gi-Oh dub and stuff, where they had the for the pointing finger gun in Yu-Gi-Oh. Whatever, there was just supposed to be a pistol. Or the lollipop instead of the cigar in uh, One Piece. <laughs> I didn't watch any of those. 
I watched a little bit of Yu-Gi-Oh! And I was like, eh. Because it was early in the morning, and I didn't want to have to keep up with that schedule just to watch Yu-Gi-Oh! <laughs> oh, I remember when I used to do that. Oh, I loved it, because I, I actually got really into Yu-Gi-Oh! 5Ds as it was coming out and being broadcasted on TVs. Now, this was before streaming was really a big thing on, say, like, Funimation and other shit's websites. Hmm. So I had to keep up with it if I wanted to keep watching it. I right. finally made it to the episode where you met this one character, and I was like, oh, she looks amazing. She's cool. Because she wore this mask and shit, and she would basically beat the shit out of anybody with psychic power. Hmm. Which she was born with. It was basically a curse of hers. And then, my little fucking cousin decided, No, I don't want to watch your show. Let's watch a stupid dog movie that there was only 15 minutes left of. <laughs> and I had to sit there and begrudgingly watch little dog movie that was already finished and they were already fighting the they were just put the fucking big bad evil guy in a vat of molasses <laughs> gross and I had to sit there and, and watch all the way to the end Because a shithead little cousin wouldn't let me finish 15 minutes of an episode. And I never got to finish that show, even to this day. You have the opportunity! Yes, I do, but the opportunity also comes with the fact that I will then be like, now I have to go do something else because someone makes me do that and then I forget to do it. By the time I want, I want to watch it. It's not the right time or I have to go do something. Why don't you do it right now? Because I gotta get this architect shit done. Do you though? I mean, I was... I was blessed with the opportunity of coming here of being the main architect slash mason I don't feel like you're obligated to yeah but also I want to do it because I don't want to do it later well you have more than one screen fucking watch something while you're doing that it's not like this game is very intensive with uh, uh what you call it with your attention span. Yeah, but if I want to pay attention to it, I want it to be the sole thing of attention. What? If I'm going to pay attention to the show, I want it to be the only thing I'm paying attention to. Well, I mean, it's not like you have to pay any sort of attention to this game. Everything is just monotonous. Like the same thing over and over. Yeah, but 10 seconds of having to, after 10 seconds having to look back at the screen, I can miss a shot or two. I don't want to rewind. Nerd. Yes, I am. Oh, I'm a big old nerd. A big I old nerd. Sure it's like a nerd, nerd, nerd. But he's the biggest nerd in the box. I go nerd, nerd. <laughs> there we go. I did try to get through some of the Yu-Gi-Oh! so I could get to that arc eventually. 
I think I stopped at like episode 60 of the original Yu Gi Oh! Mm. I did watch a bit of Yu Gi Oh! XD. Base edition. Ooh. Welcome to Neanderthal Homo Sapien Edition. Hi, my name is Paul. I actually work at a as an intern for a construction company. Neanderthal I Homo know. Sapien Edition. <laughs> it's nice to meet you, Paul. My name's Jeremy. Ew, what a terrible name. I know, right? Disgusting. Disgusting. I'm telling mom. Go ahead. I will. Be right back, I got to poo. You drag you up for some more Dimma Diggin Simulator 2020 Space Edition? Uh, sure, right after I poo. <laughs> Be right back. Alright, have fun. Make sure to tell Tugger I've, I've seen him. I couldn't help it, Doug. I was Doug taking a Doug dim a dump. Hello. 
Hello, I'm back. Anyone here? It's very quiet. Doug, when you get into a uh, voice chat. Let me see if I can add another capture. Uh, game capture, add another. Add source. It's not gonna be that specific window. We're gonna have you? Oh, not that one. I think it's this one, maybe? Yeah. There we go. Uh, we gotta move this thing down. Uh, let's rename this one into Eve. And we'll name the first one into... Main capture. There we go. So that way I can swap between this and that. Right? Hmm. Why is it not doing the thing? There we go. Oh yeah, I think that's the wrong one actually. the right one. Yeah, yeah. Connecting. Connecting. Where is this Doug Dimma shithead at?
I'm dim a digging in the belt. About dig a damn time. Where the hell have you dim a uh, been? I'm just trading with this guy. He wants to buy my belt back. Invite me. All right, one second. Yes. That's a lot of Doug Dimmadomes. <laughs> they all have a mega. <laughs> You're still in uh, the Dimmeridion, right? The what? Ridion? Ridion? Oh, yeah, that's okay. that system, yeah, yeah. Oh, by the way, now you can just check into the corporation tab and see the headquarters. I moved the headquarters to that system. To the what? I moved the uh, corporation HQ to this system. Okay. Coolio. By the way, I have a mini fleet of the same ships that you use, this little guy. Uh, so if somebody attacks us, I can just... Actually, no, wait. Ah, fuck, I left. <laughs> yeah, I left it. And started at the base. I normally just take them with me, so I can just deploy them and, you know, replace the miners with frigates whenever I need. We got seven million. Hmm. Do I have solar panels? I'm recharging my capacitor. Apparently. Uh, no. Capacitor regen. How does it regen? Probably from your engine. Why would my wouldn't my engine use my capacitor? Drain it? No, it doesn't use it just the ship itself uses it for power probably. And then your engine is just not working at the same time producing the power system. My capacitor charge is increasing. I have solar panels. <laughs> Oh god, these are still mining the same asteroids from half an hour. Abducted. Um, uh, do you know when Fuzzy will come online? No idea. He wanted me to record something for him, for someone. But like, I don't know his preference, so I send him two different sound bites to choose from. We're cooking up something special, apparently. All right, let's turn that off for now. Actually, put this in there. There you go. Okay. Asteroid died. What? Asteroid died. Used up. Are we going somewhere else now? No, oh, no. I have. Which one? Uh, yeah, the AI is just sending me a letter that the asteroid is depleted whenever I turn up. Okay. Oh, so you're still mining here? Oh, by the way, yes, I made a planetary gas extractor. Oh my. Produce already. Two hundred and twenty-one thousand 
with the box. Mm. All that oxygen just for us. No, we're good. By the way, a raw pool is. Well, I wouldn't say the best thing I have ever seen. But it's pretty damn good. Look up, look up prices. Or actually, wait, I will put it in fleet chat. Uh, uh, what compressed scordite? So, scordite, the one thing that we all hate, right? Is worth. I don't, I don't know what one, we hate. I don't play this game enough. One compressed scordite is worth 1,500. Is that a lot? Yes. Oh. Yay. For one unit of compressed. What is compressed? Holy shit, Veldspar is 2,000. Veldspar. Uh, ice. Press ice. Okay. Compressed blue. Oh my. RMJ. This is 11,000. Well. Wow. Oh, asteroids died. There's a. I don't think that should matter unless, like, the entire built died. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, hmm. I want to make a lamp, but I need naphtha. Hmm. Are you playing Life is Feudal at the same time as? Yeah, I'm streaming both. <laughs> oh no. Wait, I'm just going to hop into the voice chat of that guy that wants to buy my Veldspur soon. Alright. Money. Skinning specific knife. Hmm. I can turn the poop ingot into some, some bars. This is where I put my ingots, right? Yeah. Uh... Let's turn this thing into a, some bars. Keep the good shit into ingots. Uh, one singular ingot. Let's heat up that bad boy. Oh yeah. Uh, keep an eye on that right there. Meanwhile, well, that's doing its thing. Let's do this. Uh, get my ship and then track. Hmm. There we go. And then... Check. Yeah! Da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da
Okay, I'm gonna set up my switch because I need something else to do while I was like this, or I'm gonna go nuts. <laughs> like I said, watch the show. I know, but I want to have that be the sole thing, and later on. This is. Oh. Oh. Okay. What about that? Oh, okay, I get it. Yay! I don't know what any of this means. <laughs> uh, let's see what's going on over here. Let's make sure that this heat is still up. Fire blueprint. Hmm. Whoa. Hmm. Oh, okay, there's a wee little bar right here. Where are you? Oh, it's a skin. Okay. Whoa. Oh, hey, I got money. Sweet. Overlapping polygons detected. What if I move this over here? Yeah. Oh. Let's do this 
one over here. Can't make that one smaller. No, I can. It's just being stupid. Come on, connect. Actually, maybe I should do this. Do that. This. And there. Huzzah! Hey. Getting me that paper. Let's see what's going on over here first, before anything. All right. Let's turn this thing into some bars. Two twenty-two. Nope, keeping you away from it. Cause I don't want you stacked. Let's check what this is at. I could use one repair kit. One singular repair kit. Marvelous. Nobody better use my fucking shit or I will kill someone. Anyone touches my shit, I'm gonna cut him. I will cut you. Don't touch my shit. Get a 
off of this game. gone we can move this and then for this we can now change this to I don't think it's that one I think it might be this one yeah okay Where did it? Oh, yeah. <sighs> he went into a voice chat with someone else. Connect. 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 Thank you. Let's move you over here, and then we're going to have you as a little separate cluster. And then we're going to have you... There we go. Ah! Oh. Darn it. Bullshit. I almost had it. <laughs> I don't know if that's part of the same cluster. Doesn't feel like it. And we're gonna have you go over there. I feel like this is three at the very least let's move this over here and then over there keep you somewhere relatively around there this that There we go. Let's take this out. Connect. There we go. Yeah, this. Let's put that in there. Aha! Give me that sweet money, baby.
I wish there was a way to activate like auto mining for this. Like you can with raising and lowering the <laughs> game levels. You can always get an auto clicker. Eh. Click. Wouldn't really work because you, cause you have to click two buttons to get to it. Yeah, it can work. What are you talking about? You can set it to uh, have whatever you're trying to mine in whatever direction um, by right clicking on it once you get the options out. When you go to options, after you right click on that dirt, you can see the little things, uh, whatever you're trying to dig in whatever way. You right click that, so it's set to that whenever you click on, on the thing that you're trying to mine. Oh, that's how that works. Yeah. It's very useful. Makes sense. Yeah. Ooh, 99% accuracy. Hell yeah. Getting them sweet points, baby. Yas. Yas queen. Come on. Move. This way. Oh, no, I said move. Move. You sorry sack of shit. Genius. Huzzah. I did it again. Oh, this is what hurts my head. Oh, no. Oh, no, there's no way I'm going to pass this one. Oh, shit. Ah, oh, frick, man. I'm not going to be able to pass it, dude. This one's wild. Oh, fuck. Just submitted. <laughs> I don't think anyone ever done this one before. I think I'm the first. So this is my solution, and nobody can ever take it. I didn't pass or fail. I'm a genius. <laughs> Yay. Oh, fuck. Oh, it's absolutely disgusting. Oh, that's, that's just horrendous. It's 
like this one is overlapping, but I can't have overlapping shit. Shit overlapping is no bueno. Oh, yay! Submission. Now we're gonna have you go over here. Be a big old square. Submit. Yeah. I'm a frickin' genius. That's not what I want to. There we go. Mm -hmm. <sighs> just don't care anymore. <laughs> Doug Dimmadome, where are you at? Why are you taking so long? It's very lonely here in space. No one to talk to. No voice to comfort me. The cold vastness of the universe surrounds me. Surrounded by dust. So much space dust. Oh, woe is me. <laughs> Doug, why are you not in chat? Why are you taking so long to sell things? Uh, uh, uh. God. Get. 
Big Eggerman yeah. Jensen. Merp. Help. What did you need help with? Boredom. Dying. I think we all are. Ah. Uh, so I'm sitting here literally having to make eggs. Good. Eggs for a Pokemon. How are you cooking your eggs? Easy. By running across the bridge. Like 30 what? times. So you don't know how to hatch Pokemon? What are you talking you about? run around until they finally go, oh, and then you get a hatching sequence. Where the Pokemon pops out of an egg. What Pokemon are you playing? Sword. Gross. The newest title. The newest gross. Which, is, which I still have not beaten. It's so sad how you even started that game. Up until black and white, everything was fine. Childhood. This game was my childhood. No, it's not. Sun and Shield is fucking new. You're not. You're not even a kid. Any kid anymore? That game's not your fucking childhood. The other ones before are that your childhood. Yeah. Give me but that I still have shit. Every game ever since. You shouldn't have. You're no longer a child anymore. And the new children's day will be ruined. Ruined with yeah, filth. Yeah, of course. This is a game that has way too much burn of it. Hey, what the fuck you got against Duskull? I have to do a trade with another player. So, with this certain item called the Reaper Claw. In order to get a Duskclops to turn into a Duskull. And then I have to have them give it back to me. Why don't you just do that with two Game Boys and then transfer them to your other games? I don't have Switch. I don't have another Switch. What are you talking about Switch? I ain't talking about no dang old Switch. This game is only on Switch. Whack. That's really whack. I do have two copies of the game, though. I just would need... Another switch to do it, which I don't have, but has online status. You should probably do that. Uh, not pay another three hundred and twenty dollars just so that I can. Then you risk losing your Pokemon. Pokemon. Yeah, good thing I can catch a shit ton. They'll not all be the same. I don't care about my main team. I don't need to trade to get them to work. You never know if you get a good stat Pokemon. The only one I have to really worry about would be my shiny Bud Do. Buddy. 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 Well, that one I don't think I have to use this same evolution line to get it. But it was poop. Yeah, but it, it's a shiny, so I keep it. Oddish will destroy Budu. Yeah. Until it evolves. Magikarp will flex its splash on you. You'll get it on what? Stupid Pokemon. The new Pokemon are terrible. Eh, some are okay. Like uh I don't care green. for okay, I care for good. Ever up until black and white everything was great. 
I love Valkyrie because you can actually decorate it however you want, depending on what you do and where you do it. It changes its evolution. You and your freaking so, Pokemon decorations. Shame on you. Because it's literally a cake Pokemon. Shame on you. Shame! I was over here trying to evolve it. I'm like, why is it this thing evolving? It should have evolved by now. It should have been eaten. Like 50. Then I look to the wiki. Oh, you just have to spin it and it evolves. Eat it. Eat the Pokemon. I'll nibble it somewhere I can't survive it on stream. Eat it alive. I'll Consume its flesh. I'll nibble it out. Rip off its tendons until you hear the screaming cease. And then go find a better Pokemon. <laughs> do 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 floating in space. I'm a floating in space. I didn't mean to do that. There we go. Yeah, that's pretty. Hot dog, hot dog, hot diggity, fuck! I could probably do something else while I'm doing this. Stickity fuck. Let's see. Right. Hey, I should probably change the title. That one, yeah, yeah, that one, okay. All right, I'm gonna put Eve online update. Ta -da! Oh, why is everything going slow? Don't go slow, go fast. Why is everything going slow? Mm. Place forbidden. Which one was that one? Mm. A place forbidden. Oh, it's this one. I don't want, I just, I don't feel like it.
Why is every why is this thing going so freaking slow? Stupid. Can you hop into my stream and see if things are like going at one frame a second? Okay, one sec. It's pretty fluid. <clears throat> All right, just wait, just wait. How about now? Stand still. Oh, yeah. Little. Do, do you see it? <laughs> yeah, I see. It's going at like one frame a second. <laughs> it's literally a frame a second. <laughs> Actually, it's a frame every few seconds. Why is it doing that? Because I'm right here? What is it? I don't... Yeah, the more you're looking back, the more... The bags are... I think it's because I'm like, I don't have a, uh, for some reason, when I'm going into my stream labs and I'm looking at shit, it, it just starts slowing down on the, on the stream. I don't know why. Like, it was working fine when I was streaming both Life is Futile and this, swapping in between, but like, I don't, I don't understand. It's so confusing. Maybe it's because the program has a leak and you need to restart. Probably. It's usually the one way to fix it. But I don't feel like restarting. I'm gonna just let it float. If anyone wants to see some pretty cool space, there you go. Some pretty cool space. There's also math and science, both of which are related. Math is related to science. Such as science is related to math. Mm hmm. In the end, it's all relativity. <laughs> Hilarious. The Duke is taking forever to get back, and I don't understand why. Who knows? He 
He should have been done trading by now. You would think. Flow telemetry provides great. Hmm. Can only be redeemed if pilot is docked. Okie dokie. How do I? I think it's that one. I'm gonna go redeem some shit. Warp driving through an entire planet. Docking permission requested. Docking request accepted. The docking acceptance for this station is extremely fast. It's just instant. That's a good thing, yes. At least it doesn't take a month. What I get, what I get. What is this? Oh, just again. Open. What up? Another one. Doom, doom, Green is kind of cool. What does this do? Doesn't change anything. Skins are stupid. to do this and go back into the fitting docking permission requested maybe that's what I gotta do docking request accepted all right fittings what do we got Skins, uh, my skins. Absolutely useless. I'll put that one on. Hmm. 
info. Okay. Okay. Oh, okay. Uh, I don't. Ah, oh, fuck. That's not wrong. Yeah, fuck you. Make me spend a hundred isk to sell for one isk. Garbage. Fuck your skins. Your skins are trash. Your skins smell bad. What? Garbage skins. Active. You have to fucking pay to have your time limited skins in this game. You only have a skin temporarily that you have to pay money for? Garbage. Uh, Duke is taking forever. Duke is Duke is dipping somewhere else. Sleepy. What is imminence? Oh, it's this game. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just save all the audio in this game and just leave it right there. While it does that, I'm going to start up a different game. I might as well just go to sleep. Oh, fuck. Yeah, it's getting around that time. At this rate, I'm going to be sitting here at the grind wheel for a while with preparing for that building. Yeah, I'm, a, I'm probably, oh my god, I'm going to take a nap. I'm, I'm going to go sleep. Yeah. I'll keep on working. <laughs> Yeet. All right, that is it for this stream. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, I don't know why you would enjoy. I guess maybe you would have some sort of of a relaxing time being around here. But uh, if you want to go to sleep, <laughs> keep a following, and I'll make sure that you are so bored and so mind-numbingly exhausted. There you go to sleep by the time I'm done with my stream. So I will see you hopefully in the next one.